Yes, you. Hey, hey, we're live now, dude. I'm going live a little early, you know. I'm like that guy. Uh, I'm like that guy. I'm like that guy. That guy. Oh, what? Shoot, I dropped something. Whoa. I'm like that guy. Hey, you know that guy? That guy who warms everybody up before the show. You know, there's a guy who comes out. Hey, everybody. He warms them up. I'm that guy tonight. Woo. All right. Hey, uh, everybody have a nice week. It's Labor Day. Labor Day weekend to you Canadians. Labor Day to you Americans. By golly. I haven't worked very hard this week, though. I don't know. I don't know about you, but I didn't didn't do much. Didn't didn't do squat. So, but the show's not officially started. This is like a pre-show, a pre-game. <laughs> oh, we got a lot of good stuff to worry tonight. Though I'm telling you right now. <laughs> Pat, Pat, you better get, you better get over here and get in position. You better get in position. I'm still trying to deal. Get into position. The show's about to start. The show's about to start. To deal with the phone. Joe is about to start. Somebody's gonna win. Somebody. Somebody's gonna win. Somebody's gonna win the lost shaker of salt I possum got, tonight. Yeah, I gotta go out and come back in. Or well, let's see. everybody knows I that. Have a text. All right, I'm gonna run the opener now. The new opener. <laughs> I'm running it. Here it comes. Hey, she is so ready. I know. I told you. It was yeah. I told hey. you. Uh, all right, here we go. The new opener. There it is. I love it. Okay. You know when I roll the names, the cavalcade of stars? Yeah. I have new music. I was using Pomp and Circumstance before. Oh, yeah. I've got some crazy Swiss yodeling <laughs> that on a cassette tape. Mike Miller gave me these two cassette tapes of some woman named Elvira. And she's a Swiss you style. Elvira? No, Elvira. <laughs> E-L-V-E-R-A. She's a Swiss style yodeler, but I think she's not from Switzerland. She lives in Pennsylvania, I believe. But she did two cassette tapes. Looked like in the 80s. And so one of them wouldn't play, but the other one would play, and it was solid gold, baby. It was so, totally amazing. Is Miller here tonight? Miller, where are you? By golly, uh, he'll be here. All right, so I think it's time to. Uh, he'll be here. But that, that I hope you like the new opener, the new music. That's a possum up a simmon tree from an old Carson Robeson square dance record. That's the new music. Persimmon. No possum up. A, well, and then if you're gonna say that would be opossum oh, up. A, a persimmon tree. But that's what it would be. <laughs> <laughs> What's it gonna be, kids? Hey, tonight's show, uh, we got guests. We got guests. Hi, Faye. Hi, Phil and Annette. We got guests. Faye, Faye got her uh, possum picture. She was yeah. one of the winners. I've, Who else got theirs today? Somebody, uh, somebody got else got their Doug. possum. Doug got there. Doug yeah. who? Yeah, Doug Smith. He didn't win a possum picture. No, he got his holographic thing. Oh, that's right. He got his holographic. Yeah. Well, that's a yeah. That's for being a guest on the show. Yeah. His holographic sticker. That's right. Oh, um, everybody's wanting. Oh, the, Kelly's doing the at thing now. The coveted. Go yeah, do the at thing, folks. If you want to talk to do somebody, the at thing. go at in the first letter of their name, and then a list will appear. If, of, you, if it doesn't there. work on my phone, but it works on my computer. It works on the desktop or. And then laptop. their names, they see it. It's highlighted. And it's really cool because all the cool kids are doing that this year. Mm -hmm. But the guests tonight. Our, our friends, Claire Milner and Walt Koken, man, they're two of the sweetest people you ever meet in your life, I'm telling you right now. Utterly fabulous. I want, to, I want them to blush now, because they are really Utterly fabulous. wonderful people, and just incredible musicians. And they wrote this book, oh, i got to go to the chiropractor now, oh, like the show's canceled, I can't play, oh my god, this book, oh, oh I did, I hurt, I did something to my arm, just, oh, this book, oh, it weighs a ton. Charlie. It's... And what's it's the, about, there's it's 40, about. There's 1,400 tunes in here, people. you got to get a copy of this book. So they can see the American can... Fiddle Tune Collection. The title. Now, a typical pop. It is I, an I, immense amount of work. It's oh, a, my It's God. every tune you ever want. Immense. Every, if, it, if it ain't in here, you don't need to know it. No. I wonder no. if Up Jump the Devil is in here. <laughs> 
<laughs> but I haven't looked for up jump the devil, but that's a good one. Uh, but you know, but in typical possum style, I have to admit, I bought this on Fiddle Hangout for half price from some lady who's selling it. So I know that's what that's how that's what possums do, though you know. He's but I, so but cheap. I, but I want you to go to mudthumper.com no and get yourself a copy of this book because yeah. it is fantastic. And I and it's heavy. It's really I'm not joking. This is not. This is like. Yeah, in this, all fairness, he did that before he knew you. This is like this. Is, yeah, this is like eight hundred. Yeah. 74 pages, I mean, and it's indexed yes. three ways to Sunday, the too. The Bible, as Bruce says. It's the Bible. Yep. Man, oh, it's the oh, Bible. Oh, I, I'm, I'm done. I can't, can somebody fill in? Can we zoom somebody <laughs> in to play? Because I can't, I'm done here. I can't do it. <laughs> All oh, right. man, what's I hurt first, myself. What's our first <laughs> two? Are we supposed to play music? <laughs> Pike's Peak, here we go, C. Oh, Pike's Peak, yeah. <laughs> send it out there, whatever happens. We got no idea. We keep looking at the microphone. Why is the microphone so close to me? I want people to be able to hear you. People have complained in past <laughs> times that they couldn't hear what you were doing. So yeah, let's play another tune Yeah, now. you can't buy the second one used yet. No, you can't. Should we buy it? Should we play another tune? I, I Thomas H. What we you know what? I'm, for buying that book half price, I'm going to give myself a yeah, seat. Sorry. 
There's so, always the aftermarket, folks. Man, you know? he's so cheap. Well, yeah, she didn't want half price for it, but I, you know, <laughs> I worked. I, I worked on her a little bit. <laughs> <laughs> Answers. Webster's tune is not in the big blue book. book but neither is up, and neither is up, up, because up to the general. It's it's not a real. Tune. No, it is a tune. It's a real tune. But you say it for a hundred. Well, I know. Whenever anybody asks me the name of some tune, I don't know the just name. I just say that. that's up jump the devil. That's yeah. It. But it is a goofy tune. I'll goofy. next week. I shall perform on this very stage. Up jump the devil. By the way, you know what? I don't know if you've been watching these late night guys lately. But like you know, like I just started this week watching Conan O'Brien, and the past couple of weeks I was watching Colbert and and what's the guy on uh, Comedy Central, Trevor Noah. You know, like I was watching, uh, I was watching uh, Conan last night. And I'm going, we have higher production values than I he think does. We do. This, I mean, it's like what the heck? I think we do. As, what what's going on? I mean, like we have more you know visual interest than he does. It's. He, Possibly. he does a Zoom call and he pans to that guy Andy Richter up in the audience once in a while. And he crack. He says something you can't well, hear because he's too far away. I think he's in away. the he's, he's in, in the, the theater. He's, but he's, yeah, but he's up in the top. Yeah, floor. he's way back. And yeah, there's social distancing. You can't really see him. No, and you can't really hear what he's Could saying. Could be anybody. <laughs> for all you know, could be anybody. So Conan, listen in. You know we can help you improve the look of your show. <laughs> What do we got here? Oh, the backwoods and break the the backwoods and breakdown. The backwood oh, yeah. the backwoodsman's backwoods breakdown. Monreal, which I heard today for the first time. I just played it for today. A few minutes ago. It's indie. It's an Andy de Jarlis tune. It's if I indie, get through it. but it starts on the A7. And it goes back and forth. A seven D, A seven D. It's I might need the little chart for this. Let me see the let me see the dots. The second There's part. The dots. Let's see. Oh, the lizard brain will take over. I can't read that good anyway. Oh gosh, we didn't play that. I'm talking about when it's posted. So I'll be back with that one next week. I couldn't get the second part. It just wouldn't happen. I can't I couldn't make and, it go. And your judicial ending doesn't work. It's well, like, you know, what, what, what can you say? What can you say? Of course, not that I didn't we'll, be, make we'll be back after that one next week. I didn't make a whole I bunch promise. of mistakes anyway. <laughs> but, yeah, that's all right. It was okay. It was okay. It was, it was That's right. an Andy DeJarlis tune, and it's, uh, it's on my website. It's, uh, 
You can go get it at, uh, shall we say, shall I just tell people where they can go to get that? CharlieWalden.com forward slash dots. You can go download that tune. All right, just tonight, and you can tell me what notes I played wrong. I think I need a citizen's arrest on that, too. You better get the chicken out. Get the chicken out. Get the chicken out. I love giving myself the old citizen's arrest. Anybody there want a citizen's well, arrest? You know what? The whole people know about um, well, Kelly. What? Kelly knows about Up uh, the Devil. Up Jump the Devil is a real tune. I mean, and Jeff and Val. Of course. Hi, Jeff and Val. Hi, Jeff and Val. Thomas. You know, it's Amanda. a real tune by Byron Parker, Marilis, Hill County tune, Up Up Jump Joe. No, Up the Jump the Devil is a Tommy Jackson tune. And. Well, no. Jeff and Val say, yeah, it was a good tune played by the early cousin Curtis and Cashree Bates. No, that makes sense. That would be right up his see, alley. Who it's we'll a, see later tonight. It's a goofy tune, yeah. But, we'll see them. <laughs> Brian Parkinson. You Brian know what? Park, I, think we should, we, I think we should let people <laughs> see, see Walt and Claire now. Well, I think we should. It's a good time for that. And you know... They're playing, I ain't going to work no well, more tomorrow. Got, is that what it is? I've got one. I ain't going to work tomorrow. I can't remember what the title it's of the tune is. It's all right. here. Second part, slight, slightly like opera reel, but not if you're playing the chords. What is that? Of the one we just played. Backwoodsman's Breakdown. Yeah. Second part, it kind of sounds like opera reel, but the chords I was given from Charlie, no. Nope. Oh, well. What are you going to do? But that could change. But let's, let's, let's have Walt and Claire now. Of course. And now, sure now in the second half, it's the, Bu the fabulous Buchanan brothers from down around St. Louis Way. But I think we, let's let's have this Walton Claire thing right now. Here we go, folks. I'm gonna turn. I'm gonna turn us down. We well, Claire. Hey, Walt. Here we are on the Charlie Walden Old Possum Show. Yeah. Hi, possums. And we actually have a picture of Charlie. Oh, yeah. I guess you didn't really know that he played the banjo. <laughs> Actually, it's a painting by Kevin Kutz, who did the woodcut that's on the cover of the Highwood String Band Dance All Night DVD, which is available on monthupper.com. Sure is. And... We're going to sing a little tune about a prophetic soul as sung by the Carter family called I Ain't Gonna Work Tomorrow. Yeah.
wow, 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 wow. Oh man, that was amazing. That's like wall of freaking sound is what that is. Man, you guys are just incredible. Oh my gosh. All right, shows, that's it. I'm sorry, we can't. Yeah, we're, we, done we're done now. I'm just going to run that in a loop for the next hour and a half. <laughs> oh, man, thanks, guys. And now you'll be receiving in the post your holographic at Big Whether Phil you Show stickers. Whether you or not. That's right, that's right. Whether you would or not. <laughs> several, several have gone out. They're slowly trickling out into the populace. <laughs> but you know what? I think it's time now, actually, to run the, hol the cavalcade of stars, the list. You would not believe the fabulous artists have that have performed on this program. And you're going to you're going to see a list of them right now. This is episode 73. Can you believe that? Yeah. Wow. I can. Okay. Here here we go. It, it feels like I can. It, it only feels like episode 1000. The Cavalcade of Stars is Cavalcade in G, of Stars. Right? No, that's that's something else. That's the patrons. We don't play so, during this. I'm good. I'm good. This is the yodeling. I, can relax. I, I put in new music, the yodeling. Yodeling? Yeah. Everybody's listed there. Are you still on? I'm uh, still. People are here to be talking about this. I, I, I can switch it out. Here we go. We'll start over. This is the right one now. Oh, that's the wrong one. No, Dang, nab it. Oh man, that, this is really this is really confusing. <laughs> I'm confusing myself. Oh my god, what is going on here? Let's see. That's the that's the guests. That's the guest <laughs> roller. Here it is. Here it is. I got the right one now. I got so? the right one. There it goes. <laughs> that's the one with the yodeling. <laughs> Citizens Arrest on that. Well, you know, it's like 80s cable television. That's what Nick Lloyd said. Your show is like 80s cable access TV. It's... Jesse says it's karma fire. Talk to trash and run production value. Yeah, I was trash. Oh, yeah. I was trash and Conan, and then I made my own mistake. Well, I'm my own sound engineer, audio, uh, video engineer, uh, IT yeah. man. I've got I'm it sure all. there's young that play banjo. I'm absolutely certain. That's a, that's oh, a power, I know for sure. That is some powerful yodeling, though. I'm telling you right yeah, now, it, it is. is powerful yodeling. <laughs> Woo wee! That all oh, that confused me. I hope it didn't confuse you, folks. Oh yeah. Hey, let's play it. Wait, let's we play it. Tunes from home, shottish. Tunes oh from home, gosh. shottish. In G. All right, it's a shottish. <laughs> in G. It's in G, and the second part starts on a C. This is a good old midwestern tune. Bob I Walters heard it tune. About. 15 minutes ago. Right, we played First it once. Time. Yeah. One, two, three, one, two. That's not a waltz. Did I count off a waltz? Yeah. Okay, one, two, one. It's not a waltz, it's a shottish. <laughs> one, two, one, two, one.
R.P. Christensen book. Bob Walters played that. That's a true Midwestern number there. We got other Midwestern numbers on the lineup tonight as well. But, uh, what, what? Oh, somebody said Backwoodsman's Reel. Yes, that was Backwoodsman's Reel. I was uh, yeah. extrapolating, calling it the Backwoodsman's Breakdown. I like the, I like the alliteration. I love alliteration, don't you? I gotta back up a little bit. But yeah, see what's <laughs> going on. I'll, I'll understand it tomorrow. We'll do another citizen's awesome arrest here. Right? Yeah. 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 There it is. There it is. All right. All right. <laughs> Has anybody got a birthday tonight? Any birthdays? Any, any birthdays? Actually, they probably are. But I'll wait for you to list your birthdays yeah. there. Yeah. I'm, I'm ready with the with the birthday cake. So anybody got a birthday today? This weekend. This is an advert popped up for a fiddle tuner. Who did? Linda. <laughs> <laughs> flashing Where's lights. Well, I don't have flashing lights, but I do have flashing. Oh, we don't have the game on. Shoot. I do have flashing I got no idea. phone numbers. The break, we'll turn on the Cubs game. And that phone number. Because playing the Cardinals tonight. And that though. phone number is the hotline. And you can call the hotline right now. People have been calling the hotline. You can call <laughs> it. You can text it. It's 847-920-7587. <laughs> That's the number to call, and it is flashing, by the way. It is flashing brilliantly. Yeah, the card... The, As is the email address, bigfiddleshow at gmail.com. The clubs are still in first, by the way. The clubs? Yeah. The clubs are still in yeah, first? They're still in first. Hey, it's time to play another tune. You know what we got on tap here? What? You know you, you know David Brown, who lives out in the yeah, Bay Area? of course I do. He's here. He's here tonight? Yeah. David, are you here? Yeah, I didn't he's see. here. Okay. Well, David, yeah. you asked about... We were emailing back and forth, forward and back about a tune called Oscar's Reel. And it's from the the album of the Rian Doe family that County put out in the probably in the late 70s or early 80s. And I bought it at the record rack there in Columbia, Missouri. I said, what's this? I don't think I can even say it, Rian Doe. <laughs> Being from central Missouri, I couldn't even say any word in French. But so it had a lot of great tunes on it. You should it. hear other pronounced French towns down there. <laughs> Yeah. But it had a lot of great tunes on it, and, and David put me in mind to this Oscar's Reel in A. It's two parts, right? Two parts, yeah, just uh, both of them in A. And they both start on A. Thank God! <laughs> Thank you. 
Nelly's real. It's a, like Austin a companion Alice. tune. Go look uh, at your Coles yeah. 1000 fiddle tunes. Yep, that was, Austin that was real. totally oh, man. What is Bruce's birthday. <laughs> it's Bruce's birthday? I didn't know that. Which Bruce? Bruce Sidlock. Okay, oh Bruce. Well Bruce, yeah. what day is your birthday? Tell today. me. Today. What Today? Apparently. Well you know about what they say about. Happy your, 65. Happy You know what they say about today's. If your birthday's today, you know what it is? What is it? A date which will live in infamy. It's a date that will live in infamy. A date. <laughs> and happy birthday, Bruce. <laughs> You've never heard that thing, my date that will live in infamy, have you? I have. Yeah, okay. I I'm going to play it one more time. I'm going to play it one more time. A date which will live <laughs> get a little history in lesson. infamy. You get a lot of here on the Big Fiddle Show. You get history lesson. You get a date which will. So, All right. So it's the 65th. Yay. Yeah, that's a good one. That's a and, good one. Uh, <laughs> yeah, Eric, that was crazy. <laughs> <laughs> Austin Ellis is crazy because we played the other one. I said, is that Austin Ellis? Well, that's what made me think to do it when yeah, you mentioned No, 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 no. That's, oh, Debbie Cocos says, that's what I call Kate Burton style. Yeah, all good. That's yeah. a compliment. Thank you. Yeah. You're talking about the, you, not me. The shift of Maddox. No, I don't think it's me. But anyway, yeah, get a load of this tune. Yeah. Oh, Henry Ford was born on this September 4th. Oh, I wow. did All right. not. I did not know that. Henry Ford II. I don't know. All right, in scouts. I'll go crash. I'll go drive around <laughs> in my flivver tonight. Oh, hi, Pete. Pete's here. Oh, Pete. Oh, hey, man. Oh, your little sister's 74 today. Yay, Pat Wilcox. That's another birthday. All right. <laughs> <laughs> so now let us play. Let us play. No, no, no. I think nope. the more talking. because of the time. No, I've got one more tune. No, no. We can put that in the second half. The se Oh, the second half. You think you're running out of time? No, I'm not running out of time. Get, it is time now for to, the break. We need to. The break. It's time for the break. Space things. Space things. We need to get spaced out. <laughs> so someone's going to win tonight. Yeah, the, sure. I'm not going to call it the... B U F F E T T possum because <laughs> that would violate that, that. There would be a phalanx of lawyers, but uh, you're gonna win the the lost shaker of salt. That's probably trademark too. The lost shaker of salt possum. There it is. <laughs> I don't know if that's coming through or not. Is it? Yeah, yeah. I think it is. Yeah. So I that's what. That's oh, I've got it. I think. Oh, I think I, that's tonight. The lost shaker of salt possum. Oh, here I've got him on the. Looking at them for such a long time. I can put him on the screen right there. He is. There he is. See, he's lost something. He's wandering off to that volcano. Yeah. He's probably in Hawaii. Hawaii. <laughs> hey, John P. Yeah, your two-year-old couldn't tell the difference between us and Alice and the other one, and neither could I. Ah, <laughs> uh, you know, this is the uh, this is the this is the next to last in the series of. A, a set of drawings I made it called is? Possums. Why is it next to last? Because I'm closing out a series, Possums in Paradise. This is this this is the fifth in the series. The sixth one will be next week. It's the Possum Ota, Possum Ota San, and and Doug and Barb will know what that means. I'll explain it later. But so <laughs> it's a it's this it's this guy right here. This is the guy for next week. Oh, you already did it. Oh, I did. I'm getting ahead huh? of the game. I don't All mess right, around. All right, fine. When I mess around, I don't mess around. There he is. He's got the ukulele. Oh, I, they can't see it. I've got, yeah. I'm making them look at this. What am yeah. I doing? I'm out of my mind. Oh, okay, here we go. One more time. <laughs> you couldn't see anything. I was holding it up to the camera, but you didn't have a view of the camera. There's the guy with the ukulele. Oh, they're just talking to each other anyway. There's the ukulele guy. It's so. fine. And right. the sailboat has no people. It's just a drift. Right, it's just a drift. No, it's they're, they're laying down. They're lying down having a nap. You think so? They're lying down having a nap. All right. That's right. All right, so what it's time for the contest, kids? It's time for the contest. All right, there's a lot of conditions. Conditions? <laughs> oh, it's con terms and conditions. There are a lot of terms and conditions terms in this contest. Terms and conditions here. <laughs> from Pretty Book. 
Mostly because it's hard for me to judge at this point in the evening. But now if you do win, you know what to do. You have to send me, your, send me your address to yeah. bigfiddleshow at gmail.com. Well, we'll say that again. Well, I, I'll, I'll say right. it many times. All right. So to start out, the answer is not the name of a town, Jane. But you can go ahead and say Peoria now if you want to. But it's not going to be the right answer. Okay, so you're not supposed to say the answer till you say go. All right. Okay, let's see if I right. not mess this up. <laughs> All right, today is September 4th. And on this day in 1933, an airplane was flown at a speed over 300 miles per hour for the first time. It happened in the USA. So I want you to name the state. Go. The state. 1933. Youngsters, there were only 48 states in 1933. And this is over 300 miles an hour. First time over ever. Over 300 First time miles ever. an hour. It was at the International Air Race. Right. Lindbergh was there. Doolittle was there. Everybody was there. Everybody who was anybody in aviation. That's right. The Wright brothers, they were, were, they were there. there. The Wright brothers were there. In 1933, over 300 miles an hour. So it's the state, not the town, Jane, the state. I believe Wrong Way Corrigan was there, too, if I'm not mistaken. You know, so if nobody gets the right state, I'm going to have to do Google Maps to figure out who's Wait, the Wait, somebody's closest. already guessing. Well, yeah, it's been There's 20 guesses. seconds. There's so guesses. Pe state of euphoria, guessing. that's good, that's good. State of inebriation. And I'm going to call it online when I say it's called online. It's called. I'll give you a couple minutes. And, uh, yeah. But this is not an easy question. Okay, a big hint is 1933. How's that a big... Oh, I know what that... Shh. Oh, that gave it... Uh, that gave it away. <laughs> I know the answer now, myself. You cannot. And it's, family members are allowed to compete. Let me talk about that later. <laughs> There's so many rules. Terms and conditions <laughs> will apply. I... <laughs> <laughs> Two guesses per household. She oh. said Poughkeepsie. Wilbur died in 1912. Wow, he didn't last long after that famous flight. Victoria is not a state in America. <laughs> Who said Victoria? Virginia. <laughs> They're not that even close, are they? Guess. You better give them that clue. You better give another clue. You better give another clue. I did give a clue. Give it again. Harder. 1933. Was there something going on in 1933? Shh. Well, come on, Pat. That's enough. That's enough. We have people who are close. We have people who are close. I mean, something real related to the future might have been going All on. All right. I think we have a winner. <laughs> <laughs> no, because she's already won. No, but you have another one. You have another one. You have another one. Okay. <laughs> <laughs> All right, I'm Is calling it, it. Is it Mark? I am calling it. <laughs> but we weren't the we went the right way. That's right. Yeah, you're going the wrong way. <laughs> Man, this is gripping television. This is so exciting. People are just on the, oh, I'm on the edge of my seat. Who's going to win the, the, what possum is it? The salt, right. lost shaker okay, salt so possum. Okay, so here is another thing. Because last week, my sister asked me if, if family members were exempt. And I said no, because she put in the right answer. And it showed on her feed that she got it before Tim. But Tim, you're the winner. My sister's cool. My sister well, no, I have another cool. drawing I can give her. Yeah, you do have. Ginger, I have a special drawing. Ginger probably doesn't want it. No, I have a special drawing. I made it. I have a second one. I have these. She probably doesn't want it. I have the thanks <laughs> possum. Oh, God. That was really cool. She might not want it. We'll see, Ginger. We'll if you see. want it, we can send it to you. We'll see. So, anyway, it showed. And I went back and looked at the chat because in our chat it showed Ted getting it first. Tim, you mean? I mean, Tim. Sorry. Like I said, okay, so I'm going back here, and the first guess is, of course, we're Ohio, you know, 
you know, California, you know, Missouri. Missouri was going to be a runner-up because it borders Illinois. The closest state bordering Illinois would be Wisconsin, which nobody guessed. Until we get to, I said 1933, enough times, and you remembered it was the World's Fair in Chicago, Kansas. <laughs> uh, Marion, you got it first, but you already won. All right, Barb. You're a winner, Barb. I think you're a winner. Barb Coons? I think Barb oh, Coons wow. is a I, winner. I, oh, I thought that you knew World's Fair was in New York in 1933. Well, I missed no. it anyway. I, I was, I was going to give it to Mark Wardenberg. He no. said New York. All right, fine. No. It's the Chicago World's Fair. All right. Glenview. They set the record in Glenview. At the Naval Air Station. Well, it wasn't a naval. It was Curtis Airfield then. The Navy didn't buy it until right before World War II. But yeah, that's where it was in 1933. And that's where your dad Glenview. trained. That's where my dad trained. Uh, yeah. At but Glenview. I think Naval he already Station. knew. He already knew how to fly a plane from college in right. Monmouth, and right. that's why he ended up in the Navy after Pearl Harbor. All right, but so we have a winner. So I'll Barb check it Coons. tomorrow. Wow. But Barb, I think you're the winner, Barb. All right. Marian. Let's give a big round of applause for Barb. Marian. So we're not going to play another tune. You want to go right to the break now? We should go to the break. All right, we're going to the break. It's go to the break. Now, it's, it's, it's a little bit misleading. At the first part of the break, it says it's five minutes, but it's really only four minutes. So you only have four minutes to refresh your beverages and get whatever you're going to get done because you got four minutes. And now. Now a short intermission, so you'll have time to make your selection before the show begins. Show starts in five minutes. Show starts in four minutes. Sneaking out to the drive-in? Why not take the kiddies along and save the expense of a sitter? Everyone enjoys the drive-in. Give the demonstration of my new invention, the goodies machine. The machine turns out delumptious hot doggies one after the other. And thirst quenching sodas also. Gives popcorn of the most tasty kind, plain and buttered. Candy too, crunchy and dandy. Steaming hot coffee and ice cream too. These goodies are at a snack bar just waiting for you. Mmm, 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 mmm. Show starts in three minutes. I have our new cutlass now. Sure handles easy. Drive happy, cutlass can make you a little drive happy. I forgot to get the newspaper. Glad we ordered these swivel bucket seats. <laughs> yeah, in case I get to drive someday. The Cutlass S, Oldsmobile's sporty fastback at a price that's less than you might think to help make you really drive happy. Drive happy. Can I drive now? Show starts in two minutes. It's refreshment time. And our refreshment stand is loaded with good things to eat. There's crispy, crunchy popcorn. And hot, delicious, buttered popcorn lots of candy, and frosty, refreshing cold drinks. Why not treat yourself at the refreshment center now? At our refreshment stand, your wish is our command. 
so the coffee we serve there is pure perfection. We're now just one minute away from the beginning of our next feature. As you leave, please drive carefully and come back soon. the show and we're clear oh, no oh, and we're clear oh well, that's at the end we say and we're clear no we don't say that yet. and we're clear all right hey that was that was an incredible break <laughs> those people by the way that you see the little business card uh, little slides those are folks who played on the show so if you have played on the show and you have a concern going or otherwise or you have a band or a CD or a website just send me the information uh, if you can't make up your own little slide or you have a business card you can take a picture of, I'll make something up for you. So just get in touch with me. Email me at bigfiddleshow at gmail.com. Now I'm reaching out slowly to all the people who've played on the show, but be proactive, you know. Get in my face. All right, here we go. We're going to play. <laughs> the show went in five minutes. <laughs> <laughs> all right, I'll give, you, I'll give you the citizens of Ransom. Five minutes. Five minutes. She's already won. That's right. Has she won yeah. something? Mary ain't got a prize. What? Yeah, I haven't yeah. mailed her anything. Oh, because she was second place two weeks in a row, and I mailed oh, her. Oh, okay. So. Oh, you yeah. mailed it to her. Yeah, That's right. I did. Okay. At some point, we'll let y'all back in the contest. Well, that was before I was doing the uh, possum yeah, pictures. Yeah, the possum pictures. Right. We'll I will let continue you back the in. possum pictures, by the way. Yeah. Uh, okay, so now let us play a tune in A I'm in not six, ready eight yet. time. I'm just telling people I'm previewing what's going to happen. It's a tune in A. It's in four parts. It's in 6 oh, 8 time. Lord, this one. It's called the Little Red Barn Quadrille. Quadrille. And it's one of those North Missouri tunes, Northwest Missouri tunes, but it's also a Canadian tune. So I'm sure they got it. It's actually in Canada, the Little Red Barn is played in three parts. So Bob Walters or somebody added an extra part, but it's a good tune. Yeah, see, there was. I'm trying to think how it goes. Well, we'll see what happens. Oh, it's a rough so evening. It's a rough time. there was the 1893 Chicago World's Fair. Yes. The White City with the serial killer. Where they, where they built the and all Science that. and Industry Museum. And yeah, all the that. only thing that's left is the Science and Industry Museum, which is better than what's left in the 1933-34 Chicago World's Fair. All that's left is a brick bathroom somewhere in the park. That's it. That's the in only Grant thing Park left. Somewhere to... yeah. yeah. Well, on the lakefront. That's the only thing that's left from that one. <laughs> huh? Linda wants to know if your pictures can have a theme of you or possums landing on Mars. Oh, space possums. Space I can do possums. a possums in space. Okay, that'll be my it. next. I was going to do possums in Texas, but I, I, there are a lot of, there's a lot of time. I think I'll, I'll run with that possums in space uh, for the next six weeks. Now, I do six of these at you a know, time because... Mars, they're, Saturn, well, and, very you know, investigating visual. the nebula. I'm talking about galactic travel. Eh. Eh. But... So I do six at a time because they'll soon next week there'll be a zine. You know, you can fold up your own little your little, little booklet of all oh, the yeah. possum pictures. Everybody, will, everybody will want that. Everybody loves zines. So little red barn, four parts. A A A E. Three parts in A, one part in A, an E. Three. <laughs>
quickly in order. One, two, three, four, two, three, it one. Didn't. It didn't. <laughs> but you did good following me, Pat. <laughs> Woo, I'm telling you right now. What? They play Aldrin Vine with Steamboat Quick Step in Minnesota. Oh, nice. Cool. Oh, okay. I'll have to. All right. I need to learn the Steamboat Quick Step, I think, from you. the app Susan? stuff, which yeah. is. Yeah, cool. use that app like, thing. The at, oh, wait a minute. You gotta smash the like button. Oh yeah, hit that like button. Tear it up. We got, we got 26. Like we got we up to 26. Crush it. Pat okay, says crush it. Crush it. Crush it. Crush it. Crush it. Crush it. If, you, if, you can't, if you're on a mobile device and you can't crush it now, crush it later after the show. You can go go onto your computer and crush it. All right. We got another one today here. What do we got? Oh, it's a good one. But you know, first let's play a little yeah. turkey in a straw. You know, a little turkey in a straw. Because you know. Art. That would be good. Because you know, pol we can do polka and possums. Keep the themes coming. <laughs> so, you know, I we're going to roll John. now the list of people who are patrons at patreon.com forward slash Charlie Walton. I don't even turn Go, go check it out. Stuff. Go check it out. All right, there. we're going to get ready to play Turkey in the Straw in G. Right? Are you ready? Are you ready? Are you ready? Texas rolls. Are you ready? Are you ready? Here we go. Get ready. Here we go. <laughs> We'll do that after this. Two Texas Sea tunes in a row. So you know, Marinelle, she wanted to hear. Yeah, it was her. Little, little she... Egypt was at the fair. That dancer was at the fair. I think Marinelle wanted to hear we'll Waltz Across Texas, didn't she? No, it was Gene. Gene, Gene did, okay. Wanted to hear it. Some of the, one of our Texas friends, would you tune this ukulele for me, please? Yeah, I can do that. She's got a much better ear than me. Actually, she just cares more than I do, it's most of it. <laughs> Get your song sheets out. I posted this on the Facebook page. But the, the chorus, you can everybody can sing along the chorus. It goes, Waltz across Texas with you in my arms. Waltz across Texas with you. Like a storybook ending, I'm lost in your charms. And I could waltz across Texas with you. Here we go. In the key of A. Well, you didn't post the song. No, it's up there. What? From years. From, from years, not years. From, from time. months back, we didn't announce it's it. It's only got two chords. It's only got two a, chords. A. And, and how do you make an E on this thing again? If you're a guitarist, you think it's a B. Yeah, a B7. If you're a guitarist. No, it's still an A. It's it's in A. I'm making it. The, the key, actual key is A. Don't tell them to play you know, B. There's no B7s. You're transposing. Now now you're transposing like it's a ukulele. The B, ukulele plays a B7. So if I'm in charge of the tune, it's up there. He's in charge of the tune. It's there. It's got two chords. I, I Should I walk them through the chorus together? Everybody speak. No. Say it with me now. Say it no. with me. No, because... Waltz across Texas with you in my arms. Waltz across Texas with you. Like a storybook <laughs> ending, I'm lost in your charms. And I could waltz across Texas with you. Here we go. Big play me an E chord. When we dance together, my world's in disguise. It's a fairyland tale that's come true. When you look at me with those stars in your eyes, I can fall. Across Texas with you. 
number but you can chat for a moment keep up keep up try to keep up Pat. people are saying I'm a lot trying to keep up <laughs> he only knew two chords yeah and he had that thing on the back thanks he flipped his guitar up and said he had thanks written on the back of his guitar so he, I need to put that on ice Chris can you engrave thanks on the back of this little <laughs> <laughs> with the with the rhinestones <laughs> Gene says Ernest only knew two chords. <laughs> <laughs> oh, yeah, Ernest Possum. That could be another theme of possum drawings. Co possums as country western <laughs> stars. There could be like Loretta Possum. You know, I could, you know, uh, who, who sang with George Jones? Uh, come on, help, help me. Tammy Wynette Possum, you know, with the big hair. Be good. Well, I saw her in person in Dubuque, Iowa. <laughs> yep, I did. Well, she stood by her man, that's all I can say. Warren says it'd be nice to hear Oklahoma Redbird. That's good. Maybe we'll, maybe we'll do that. Maybe we'll maybe, do that. Maybe that could be our encore. We'll okay. plan for an encore yeah, in case might, you want one. We might have an encore. If you don't want one, we won't play one. But. All right, so let's play a little bit of that Bear Creek Hop. It's an A. It's another Texas thing. Uh, Cousin Cecil Brewer recorded that. Cousin Cecil Brower. Brower? Brewer. 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 Oh, Cecil playing? Brewer. He played with the uh, Light Crust Doughboys. He was actually a professional violinist. He has an interesting Wikipedia page. Cousin... Cecil Brewer. So let's play a little Bear Creek Hop. Hey, hey. hey. Bear Creek Hop. That's not a bad tune. Good oh, yeah. square dance tune. I think 
everybody that went to Bethel knows oh, that Oh, all the kids. We, that was when we talked to all the kids Everybody in Bethel. that went to Bethel knows that too. Yeah. Oh, what's going on here? All right, folks. That's the Bear Creek Hop. <laughs> <laughs> we're down to three. We're down to three. We got, Are we? we? Yeah, we're down to three. Yeah, what, are gonna, <laughs> what are we going to do? Oh, the likes went up to 30 now. Now that's what I'm talking about. That, make, that makes life worth liking. <laughs> Ernie's tea possum <laughs> throwing rocks. Yeah, Dolly possum. Yeah. Dolly po oh, yeah. yeah that, the the yeah. punsters are out. Yeah, the May we could have a Mayberry are. series. Just yeah. Mayberry. That could be like, Mayberry. you know, Barney possum, rhinestone Floyd the barber possum. possum. Yeah, rhinestone possum. I've got some glue on rhinestones. We could decorate your stuff with it. Or possums in nudie suits. I could model, the, I could look up nudie oh, suits of famous people. Yeah. And I could draw oh, the nudie suits. Oh, there's a ton suits. of them. That's, that's, a, that's a good one, too. That might be beyond... My artistic capability. It might be beyond your detail. I, I, beg, I beg your pardon. Might, Did you see the flowers on those board shorts for the next week's one? I mean, that's really... Let's look at that, because I've got... To, there's time. You know what? Let's talk about upcoming events on Possum's Big Fiddle Show. Is in it the, tomorrow in, morning? In the, in the Possum's Big Fiddle Show Media Empire. It's a, with its vast tentacles reaching out into all corners of the globe. Tomorrow morning is the Camp Possum Jam Session, and we're going to teach the tune Whistlin' Rufus. So if you want to learn to play Whistlin' Rufus, or you just want to play with along with us with the 18 tunes we already learned at Camp Possum, come and have your mind blown. I mean, really, I'm serious. Come and have your mind blown. And then, you know what? Eight weeks have passed with... With our Duffers series, we got Fiddle for Duffers, Mando for Duffers, Guitar Backup for Duffers. Eight weeks have passed. Everyone graduated, and it's time for Fiddle for Duffers 2 on Tuesday morning at 11. Mando for Duffers 2, Wednesday morning at 11. Guitar Backup for Duffers 2, Thursday morning at 11. And I left out the, uh, oh, and next week is Big Fiddle Show number 74, Friday night. So don't miss that. You and somebody's going to win the oh, Ota Son possum. The what? Possum Son. Possum Son. He's got Herb Ota's hair. I, I modeled that hair after Herb Ota. So uh, go, go look at his picture. Herb Ota Son. Go look at his picture. That possum has that exact hair that Herb ah. Ota had in the 50s. So so let's go along here and hey, don't forget wait, all wait, that wait, good wait, stuff. Wait, what? Wait, what? Yeah. Uh, uh, Cheryl brought up that the first possum was... George Jones, he's older than you. Well, that's right. He's no longer amongst he's, us. He's the possum. But, the but possum he is dead. had nudie suits like you wouldn't believe. But you know what I say George when people Jones tell me about did. George Jones? I say, the possum is dead, long live the possum. <laughs> so. That's so callous. <laughs> oh, come on. He, the guy drove around on a golf cart. I mean, on a, on a lawnmower. He drove to the liquor store with a, on a lawnmower. I mean, come on. Well, that's cool. I've never done that. I've that's never, cool. I've never done that. It's because we don't have a lawnmower. That's why you haven't done that. <laughs> no, I love George Jones. He's amazing. Yeah, he is. <laughs> what are you playing? All right, we're going to play a little bit of the Indian Reel in G oh, and C. Yeah, first part's in G, second part's in C. A Quebecois tune. Quebec, a Quebec tune. Not too fast. Whose fault is that?
Jo- say? That's a Joseph Allard tune, I believe. <laughs> Skip the landmark. Get it, goat. Yeah. Goats are cute. <laughs> goats are baby goats. Almost baby took over goats. the internet for a while, yeah. but cats beat them back. Cats, cats, yeah, cats yeah. push back can't hard. Can't beat the cats, you know. Kittens push back hard against the baby goats. So yeah. the, the baby goats are on the verge of taking over yeah. the internet. The switch to the key of C is unexpected, so I usually miss it. Marinelle. <laughs> 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 oh man, I'm telling you, what else do I need to do? Oh, I ran Kevin my Valley, go to the liquor store now on their riding mower. <laughs> I rolled I rolled I rolled the patrons. I rolled the guests. Uh, uh what else do I need to no, do? No, here? We, we have the Buchanan brothers. Come on. I don't think we've done both of them, have we? No, we have to play the Buchanan brothers video. Yes, we do. Come Gosh. on, man. Come on. We could have oh man. That was that you, was major. I'm glad I'm, I, I'm glad watched. somebody I'm glad somebody was thinking. I'm glad somebody was thinking. No, they're going to play a beautiful tune called, these are, well, let me just preface this whole video. It's like really an amazing <laughs> video. Can I just say, first, this, this was filmed in the, I don't know if you've watched the movie Goodfellas, but it was filmed in the grotto of one of the Italian restaurants featured in Goodfellas. I don't know if you'd realize that or not, but it's, it's, it's a grotto, like it's an Italian pizza restaurant in New York City. They filmed it specially there. In a grotto of uh, beautiful stonework, marble work, and then uh, so th- there's a guitar. Uh, he's playing the David Allen Coa guitar, and Kurt's playing the mandolin. Da- uh, Dennis is playing oh, that's the guitar. That's the guitar y'all want, yeah, David, by the way. David Allen yeah. Coa is what it's called. So uh, uh, and they're playing a beautiful tune called the Black Velvet Waltz, which is a tune I always associate with a guy named Al Cherney, who was a great fiddler up in Canada in the fifties and sixties. So let's play. Let's let, well, let's not, I'm not going to play. These guys are going to play. Dennis and Kirk Buchanan, here they go. Hello, friends and neighbors. This is uh, the Buchanan Brothers, and we're playing, happy to be playing for you on the Big Fiddle Show. Howdy, Pat and Possum to you. And this is uh, an old waltz called the Black Velvet Waltz. It's immaterial what it is.
There we go. I moved, I moved the wrong button, pushed the wrong button. You should see this control panel. It's like, it, it's like, the, it's like putting a monkey in an X-15, you know? It's just his computer. But, <laughs> but yeah, there's a lot of things to push. But can man, be made. That was but fabulous, that was guys. Wonderful. That was amazing. I love that waltz, too. That's great. Great, great yeah, waltz. Yeah, that was just beautiful. Beautiful. I think they were playing it in G, too, if I'm not mistaken. I usually play it in C. That was really nice, set in G there. So, uh, wow, so, thanks, guys. That was like, you know, realize those guys have been on the show four times? Well, of course. That's amazing. I mean, I, send me four more, guys. They're you big know. contributors. They are. They're big, they're major supporters. Yeah, to, for, they are. But, yeah. And, uh, now... We don't need a lawnmower because we just got a patch of weeds. And <laughs> during the last big drought when nobody was allowed to water their lawns, 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 we had the only green front yard because it's a yard full of weeds. And they're green in a drought. And actually if you go out in the snow and put the snow away, all your weeds are still green all winter long. Yeah, well, they're, they're native plants. You, you didn't know, know that, but... They're they're hardy yeah, native they're plants. They're green all the time. And yeah, Jeff is going to drive you to the liquor store. On his lawnmower. That's great, two man. Two miles to the liquor store. The Briggs and Stratton store. five horse. That's something to look forward to. With the, gov with the governor That's on it. That's something to look forward to. We'll take to. the governor off. We might get it up to 15 or 20 miles an hour if we do that. <laughs> so we're going to do another waltz now? Yes, we're going to play the Stars and Stripes waltz oh, by request. Oh, because this was requested by somebody. Yeah. We don't mind playing it. It's fun. Oh, you see? One, two, three, one, two. Reenact the chariot scene from Ben Hur. Oh, bitch! Yes. <laughs> Ballad, I could be on one. You and Jeff could be on the other one. Oh yeah, cool. 
<laughs> what if they'd used riding lawnmowers and been her? Think about that. Think about that overnight and come back with some answers. Though. <laughs> All right. So you know what I'd like? What I'd like to play? You know what I like to play now? I'm trying to figure out what everybody's talking about, but I'm not sure. <laughs> we have no idea. What was the movie with the guy who traveled across the country on a lawnmower? There uh, was. There was, oh. Uh, was there a movie about a guy who traveled across the country on a lawnmower? Well, we just don't know, <laughs> do we? And i got to figure out this, this stuff before. But... <laughs> <laughs> Thanks, Warren. <laughs> so let, we're gonna play. We're gonna finish up with Whistling Rufus. Well, there was another one you might play. So we might at the end play. Uh, but I forgot uh, what we had a request was. for Oklahoma Redbird. Oh yeah. Yeah. But Whistling Rufus is tomorrow's tune at Camp Possum, 11 a.m. right here. We'll play for an hour and a half. We'll play the Camp Possum repertoire, and then we'll learn to play Whistling Rufus. That was a Chris Germain request. What, what key is this in? G. G. Ooh. <laughs> something entirely different. Back <laughs> off! She does yells that to me all the time. Back up. Back off! Sucker. <laughs> <laughs> so, we're going to play one more and there was requested Oklahoma somebody Redbird. up way long ago and I'm sorry I don't remember who it requested. It might have been Warren. Might have been Warren. Oklahoma Redbird. An Alignment in low tune in B flat. Here we go. B flat? I'll give you an eight, I'll give you eight potatoes. Ready? Eight. <laughs> Thank you. 
Melinda. Silence is golden. No, old Melinda. <laughs> Oh, uh, old Melinda. Yes, yeah, that's all right. You want to play a little bit? Melinda, you're, then we'll... you're fired up, aren't you? Yeah, I'm fired up. Well, you want to play? We can play a few more. People can just leave no, when they want old to. No, Melinda. They, they don't have to go home. Oh, yeah, they might have to. I'm supposed to watch a zombie movie with Jesse, but that's not till 10, so. No, we're good. We're good. <laughs> oh, the game's still on. I don't even know the score is. I'm sorry. There's only one to a household. So. The sticker. You just don't want to order anymore. Just it. I've got to keep. I've got to. Somebody's got to manage the costs. The cost overruns are ridiculous on this show. So everybody, we'd like to see you again real soon. 
And tomorrow would be soon enough, I think. That'd be oh, that's just about right. Good morning. So, <laughs> that's about all they can take. Uh, that's about all they can yeah. Folks, thanks a lot. And we're, here we go. Time to start waving. All right. Time to start waving. Get ready. Well, are you ready? Are you ready? And. Bow to your partner. Yeah, I have changed the music. Your corner. Yeah, we're a little picture. Wait. Join your hands in a circle to the lab. That's the Georgia. That's the Georgia thing. The other way back. I know Ellen likes this particularly well. She gets it. It's a brain. It's a brain. It's a brain. And you wait to swing your own. Promenade the hall. All right, time for the slideshow. Oh, send in your slides. Slides. I need more slides. People send them in. But I'll work up the slides, so it's slow. The first lady promenade the inside. Just send in the slides. Good night, everybody. Just stop and take a swing. Everybody raise left hand, march around the ring. Like we are marching to Georgia. Hip, hip. Hooray. You're going the right way. Hip, hip. Hooray. You're going the wrong way. When you get to your backyard, stop and take a swing. Swing like we used to swing in Georgia. The second lady promenade the inside of the ring. Oh, when you get to your backyard, you stop and take a swing. Everybody raise left hand, march around the ring. Like we are marching to Georgia. Hip, hip. Hooray. You're going the right way. Hip, hip. Hooray. You're going the wrong way. When you get to your backyard, stop, take a swing. Swing like we used to swing in Georgia. The third lady promenade the inside of the ring. When you get to your backyard, you stop and take a swing. Everybody raise left hands, march around the ring. Like we were marching to Georgia. Hip, hip, hooray! You're going the wrong way. Hip, hip, hooray! You're going the wrong way. Oh, when you get to your backyard, stop and take a swing. Swing like we used to swing in Georgia. The last lady promenade the inside of the ring. When you get to your boyfriend, just stop and take a swing. Everybody raise left hand, march around the ring. Like we are marching to Georgia. Hip, hip, hooray! You're going the right way. Hip, hip, hooray! You're going the wrong way. When you get to your backyard, stop and take a swing. Swing like we used to swing to Georgia. Now, if somebody over by the Victrola will put the needle back, the gentleman will go out in place of the ladies. Bow to your partners and to your corners. Join your hand in a circle to the left. The other way back in the same old track. Take your feet, go wiggity whack. Then stop and swing when you get home. Dance, you wait and swing your own. Promenade the hall, promenade. The first lady promenade the inside of the ring. When you get to your backyard, you stop and take a swing. Everybody raise left hand, march around the ring. Like we are marching to Georgia. Hip, hip. Hooray. You're going the right way. Hip, hip. Hooray. You're going the wrong way. When you get to your backyard, stop and take a swing. Swing like we used to swing in Georgia. The second lady promenade the inside of the ring. Oh, when you get to your backyard, you stop and take a swing. Everybody raise left hand, march around the ring. Like we are marching to Georgia. Hip, hip. Hooray. You're going the right way. Hip, hip. Hooray. You're going the wrong way. When you get to your backyard, stop, take a swing. Swing like we used to swing in Georgia. The third lady promenade the inside of the ring. When you get to your backyard, you stop and take a swing. Everybody raise left hand, march around the ring. Like we were marching to Georgia. Hip, hip, hooray! You're going the wrong way. Hip, hip, hooray! You're going the wrong way. When you get to your backyard, stop and take a swing. Swing like we used to swing in Georgia. The last lady promenade the inside of the ring. When you get to your boyfriend.
boyfriend just stop and take a swing. Everybody raise left hand, march around the ring, like we are marching to Georgia. Hip, hip, hooray! You're going to the right way! Hip, hip, hooray! You're going the wrong way! Let's kick into your backyard, stop and take a swing, swing like we used to swing to Georgia. Now, if somebody over by the Victrola will put the needle back, the gentleman will go out and place it the latest. Bow to your partners and to your corners. Join your hands in a circle to the left. The other way back in the same old track. Take your feet, go wiggity whack. And stop and swing when you get home. Dance, you wait and swing your own. Promenade the hall, promenade. The first lady promenade the inside of the ring. When you get to your backyard, you stop and take a swing. Everybody raise left hand, march around the ring. Like we are marching to Georgia. Hip, hip. Hooray! You're going the right way. Hip, hip. Hooray! You're going the wrong way. When you get to your backyard, stop and take a swing. Swing like we used to swing in Georgia. The second lady promenade the inside of the ring. Oh, when you get to your backyard, you stop and take a swing. Everybody raise left hand, march around the ring. Like we are marching to Georgia. Hip, hip. Hooray! You're going the right way! Hip, hip! Hooray! You're going the wrong way! When you get to your backyard, stop, take a swing. Swing like we used to swing in Georgia. The third lady promenade the inside of the ring. When you get to your backyard, you stop and take a swing. Everybody raise left hand, march around the ring. Like we were marching to Georgia. Hip, hip! Hooray! You're going the wrong way! Hip, hip! Hooray! You're going the wrong way! Oh, when you get to your backyard, stop and take a swing. Swing like we used to swing in Georgia. The last lady promenade the inside of the ring. Oh, when you get to your boyfriend, just stop and take a swing. Everybody raise left hand, march around the ring. Like we were marching to Georgia. Hip, hip! Hooray! You're going the right way! Hip, hip! Hooray! You're going the wrong way! Let's kick it to your backyard, stop, take a swing. Swing like we used to swing to Georgia. Now, if somebody over by the Victrola will put the needle back, the gentleman will go out and place it the latest. Bow to your partners and to your corners. Join your hand in a circle to the left. The other way back in the same old track. Take your feet, go wiggity whack. And stop and swing when you get home. Dance, you wait and swing your own. Promenade the hall, promenade. First lady promenade the inside of the ring. When you get to your backyard, you stop and take a swing. Everybody raise left hand, march around the ring. Like we are marching to Georgia. Hip, hip, hooray! You're going the right way. Hip, hip, hooray! You're going the wrong way. When you get to your backyard, stop and take a swing. Swing like we used to swing in Georgia. The second lady promenade the inside of the ring. Oh, when they get to your backyard, you stop and take a swing. Everybody raise left hand, march around the ring. Like we are marching to Georgia. Hip, hip, hooray! You're going the right way. Hip, hip, hooray! You're going the wrong way. When you get to your backyard, stop, take a swing. Swing like we used to swing in Georgia. The third lady promenade the inside of the ring. When you get to your backyard, you stop and take a swing. Everybody raise left hand, march around the ring. Like we were marching to Georgia. Hip, hip, hooray! You're going the wrong way. Hip, hip, hooray! You're going the wrong way. When you get to your backyard, stop and take a swing. Swing like we used to swing in Georgia. The last lady promised.
promenade the inside of the ring. When you get to your boyfriend, just stop and take a swing. Everybody raise left hand, march around the ring. Like we are marching to Georgia. Hip, hip. Hooray. You're going to the right way. Hip, hip. Hooray. You're going the wrong way. When you get to your backyard, stop and take a swing. Swing like we used to swing to Georgia. Now, if somebody over by the Victrola will put the needle back, the gentleman will go out in place of the ladies. Bow to your partners and to your corners. Join your hands in a circle to the left. The other way back in the same old track. Take your feet, go wiggity whack. Then stop and swing when you get home. Then you wait and swing your own. And promenade the whole promenade. First lady promenade the inside of the ring. When you get to your backyard, you stop and take a swing. Everybody raise left hand, march around the ring. Like we are marching to Georgia. Hip, hip, hooray! You're going the right way. Hip, hip, hooray! You're going the wrong way. When you get to your backyard, stop and take a swing. Swing like we used to swing in Georgia. The second lady promenade the inside of the ring. Oh, when you get to your backyard, you stop and take a swing. Everybody raise left hand, march around the ring. Like we are marching to Georgia. Hip, hip, hooray! You're going the right way. Hip, hip, hooray! You're going the wrong way. When you get to your backyard, stop, take a swing. Swing like we used to swing in Georgia. The third lady promenade the inside of the ring. When you get to your backyard, you stop and take a swing. Everybody raise left hand, march around the ring. Like we were marching to Georgia. Hip, hip, hooray! You're going the wrong way. Hip, hip, hooray! You're going the wrong way. When you get to your backyard, stop and take a swing. Swing like we used to swing in Georgia. The last lady promenade the inside of the ring. When you get to your boyfriend, just stop and take a swing. Everybody raise left hand, march around the ring. Like we are marching to Georgia. Hip, hip, hooray! You're going the right way. Hip, hip, hooray! You're going the wrong way. When you get to your backyard, stop and take a swing. Swing like we used to swing to Georgia. Now, if somebody over by the Victrola will put the needle back, the gentleman will go out in place of the ladies. Bow to your partners and to your corners. Join your hands in a circle to the left. The other way back in the same old track. Take your feet, go wiggity whack. Then stop and swing when you get home. Then you wait and swing your own. And promenade the whole promenade. The first lady promenade the inside of the ring. When you get to your backyard, you stop and take a swing. Everybody raise left hand, march around the ring. Like we were marching to Georgia. Hip, hip, 